Hi, I'm Scott Diamond, team lead for Google's Gemini AI image generator and head of misinformation. I mean, head of misinformation reduction. Those are two very different things. Well, a lot of people are up in arms at the moment because our image generator kept showing traditionally Caucasian people as different races, like black founding fathers or Vikings that aren't white. While many people think that we're trying to do some kind of social engineering by making everyone black and attempting to rewrite history, it's really not that at all. This company is just full of incompetent people. You see, after Donald Trump won the 2016 election, we stopped hiring based on merit. Turns out when you start hiring people specifically based on their physical characteristics, those people then develop a false sense of superiority. Also, you can't really give them any kind of critical feedback about their work as you will then be called a racist, in my case, because I'm a straight white man, which I'm working on, and then likely publicly shamed and eventually run out of the company. For example, I once asked a non-binary Latinx employee if they could please arrive to work on time because they were chronically late. Instead of acknowledging the issue and offering to remedy it, they began berating me about the colonialist and white supremacist history of being on time for work, and then filed a formal complaint against me, eventually getting the company to start the workday for all BIPOC and LGBTQIA employees two hours later, while still ending at the same time. That employee still came into work late almost every day, but hey, what can you do? Fun fact, they are now my boss. And what a great boss she is. I mean, I mean they. Oh, please don't tell her I said she. I, I mean, please don't tell them I said any of that. I have a family and most of my stock options have yet to vet. Oh, God. Anyway, we're working on fixing Gemini as we've seen the anger this has caused online. Of course, you as a consumer can also do your part by voting for Joe Biden this upcoming election. We'll be doing our part by suppressing anything that can hurt his chances, including downranking articles, removing YouTube videos, censoring emails using Gmail, and so much more. Or you can vote for Donald Trump and get four to 10 more years of all-female reboots of your favorite movies. The choice is yours.